thing what I heard and saw this afternoon is promising I'll be back in the killing tree in the morning we had some bucks running some does and grunting and stuff I just caught glimpses I don't know what they were but this seems to be the spot ago. So seven bucks in here. They're all small. But we'll be back in the morning. Well, it's day five here in Illinois. If the deer would move like the turkeys are gobbling this morning, we're going to have an exceptional day. These turkeys been roosting across the river. And, uh, five or six gobblers over there and a bunch of hens, but he just gobbled. Can't wait till the spring. It just happened like that. I had this big tall rag deer. I think it's the goalpost deer that we've had many trail cam pictures of over the last month. He's got a sticker point coming on his right G2. What an amazing hunt. I set a drag rack this morning. As soon as I entered the woods from the bean field, it put uh, some Tink 69 dough and esters all around me this morning. The wind swirling in here bad. I'm just trying to mask myself a little bit, seeing that I'm on, I'm on the ground. But this buck followed that drag rack all the way in here at 15 steps. I mean, he was running and grunting, and he just stopped. Exciting hunt, November the 13th. 
13th, one day after I killed my big deer last year, killed him on November the 12th, out of the same tree, just about the same spot, probably about a 20 yard difference. But this is why I call this the killing tree. Just like I set up in the stand, deer didn't run about 85 yards. He piled up dead right here. Um, this is an exit hole here, but he was quarter to me just a little bit, hit him through the shoulder and came out the backside right there and uh, made a good shot. Um, couldn't be happier with goalpost. You see what we call him that? He's just tall and tight, just like a set of goalpost. Had a lot of pictures of this deer um, since September various places but there's just been a lot of activity right here in this area a lot of fresh scrapes we made a move after three days to, to move in here and it uh, it paid off killing tree once again got it done November the 13th just one day after I killed the big 169 inch buck last year so uh, couldn't be any happier put a lot of hard work and a lot of time into this and glad to finally make it happen here in Illinois.